Do you know that any sufficient advancement will undermine religion? What has this got to do with the mark of the beast or the number 666? Hello and welcome to Live Above 3D. Before we start, the scenario we present after this brief reading of the Bible will introduce an unexpected twist, so don't miss it. The Bible records that in the end times, a being, which the Bible calls the beast, will display superior advancement, which the Bible calls miracles. Humans will be convinced that we need to embrace this new wisdom to solve our problems. The being will convince humans to project this new wisdom onto a platform, basically a form that is relatable to humans. This new wisdom is so superior that it will be elevated above religion. This elevation will be resisted by some. The world will choose to enforce the elevation of this wisdom above religion, since the wisdom demonstrated the ability to solve human problems. The enforcement will be done through a mark which ensures humans can be monitored. The number you can use to identify the mark of the beast is often referred to as 666. This looks like some fairy tale until you consider the following scenario. D-360. Multiple AI providers claim to have achieved some form of artificial general intelligence. D-270. An agreement is reached to test a super AI made by connecting all the major AIs. D-240. During the first test, the super AI generates a series of solutions that would solve some of mankind's most pressing problems. D-210. The prospects are so life-changing that mankind decides to create a platform for this super AI to expand its influence. There is one catch. The super AI thinks that religion, at least the way it is currently practiced, is one of the problems with mankind. The super AI proposes a better way to practice religion. Many reject this proposal. The super AI, through multiple contributions to human advancement, begin to wear down opposition to its proposal regarding religion. D-30. It is decided that everyone should follow the proposals of the AI regarding religion. A chip is seen as the best way to enforce the decision. D-Day. A series of laws are passed to enforce the use of the chip. Is this scenario far-fetched? What do you think? Hmm. This scenario would also work with aliens in place of AI. Before we go, speaking of solving human problems, did you know that the creator of humans is offering a free solution to all human problems? Our creator, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, is inviting all humans to join a new kingdom which will not be subject to the problems currently faced by mankind. Those who accept, that is, the subjects of this kingdom, become a new race of beings. In various places, the Bible calls this new race, new creature, royal, priests, and partakers of the divine nature. Jesus Christ is the mediator of this new race, and all humans are invited to be part, including you. I am tempted to say it costs nothing, however, it costs one thing, your heart. You have to give your heart to Yahweh. Yahweh is love, so you will be giving your heart to love. If this invitation of love warms your heart and you want to be part of Yahweh's new race, contact me and I will show you how or point you to someone who will. My email is in the description to this video. Thanks for listening. Share this with someone who needs to know. Follow us to learn more.